All right, what is up, you beautiful people, and welcome back to the Kitchen Sink Brawl. This game is going to be dedicated uh, for, to a request by um, <clears throat> by Joshua W. Bring a stack breaker build uh, into this game. So uh, we're going to make it happen, boys. I'm going to send out two Hellbats to start. Still going to start with Han Horner, but we're basically just going to be on Karax. And Z no, we're going to be on Karax for the... Um, for the for the detonation um and we're just gonna be zagara basically the entire time uh and we'll have stepman banelings recruited into the mix so that that'll basically be it um <clears throat> let's pick a nice aura for uh this um hmm. stack breaker aura maybe just fire plus two damage you know um can never go wrong with more damage all right, <clears throat> so brawl modifiers, I guess if you guys don't know, we have the aura, just like a little buff there. There's no middle income bonus, and we can switch between commanders, which is why uh, we're starting as Hot and Horner, because this counts down our <clears throat> call in the fleet ability. And then we're probably just going to tech to Zagara. Oh, we have a Zagara on this team as well. Nice. So we're just going to go pure stack breaker. I'm pretty sure Sovereign BCs kind of suck against Scourge. Um, so that's actually a good thing. So I'm going to switch to Karak so we can start counting down into Karak's Orbital Beacon. And then I might actually go to, uh, Stepman to get some gear reaction in there. Uh, I'm actually going to get the Immolation Fluid because that's actually pretty good. Um, and then let's go over to Karax and then get one of these. So Orbital Strike Beacon is going to start counting down here. So I'm also going to start repairing my guys here, which is good. I got the repair thing, so that's going to be great. Uh, maybe I'll get an energizer to actually like support these guys. Uh, but for the most part, I'm gonna try and save my dollars. We got a Tychus there. Uh, unsurprising. But I'm gonna save my dollars. <clears throat> Karax is, uh, has a nice like shield battery thing going on here. So, uh, Parasis? Oh. Parish. Is that Parish? Oh my god. He just got wailed on by those mag mines. Here, there we go. I'm gonna put down a shield battery here. Especially the Karax is pretty good, actually. Um, wait, Karax is 480 on the Purifier Colossus? Man. Purifier Colossi are just too strong right now. Literally, Karax unplayable. Okay, we just gotta, we just gotta, like, stim our guys up here. There we go. The Queens are gonna attack a bit faster now. This guy bought these... Th oh! Wait, Broodmutas might actually be a problem. Uh, Stepman can handle that. A Stepman can handle that. <laughs> Broodmutalisk will just disappear. Yeah. I also upgraded ground armor because I typed S for Stepman. The power of missile. There we go. Got the annihilators here. Uh, I'm going to swap over to Stepman actually. Uh, maybe do I want to swap with the Stepman? Yeah, I'm gonna swap the Stepman. That's gonna put an end to that real quick. I just keep forgetting where Stepman is. Um, Gary! Let's get that Gary over here. Get some stim on Gary. This guy's playing pure Zagara. Bold. Very bold. I wanna put a defensive structure here. I realize I could have put down a Karax, um, whatchamacallit thingy. Karax beacon. Um, not beacon, Kedarn monolith. And that would have been pretty good, but uh, I don't have one. Hee <laughs> hee. Uh, uh-oh, Mutalisk. What are Mutalisk? What are Mutalisk besides fodder to my Egorb? There we go. His stack got broken by that Egorb. Uh, and then now I want to actually gas up and then put down some Mecha Banelings. The classic. Alarak showing off why he is good. There we go. <clears throat> Come on. He's getting pounded, boys. Oh my god. Pound him. Take him to Pound Town. Anti armor. Um, the feel when Tychus is not armored. I think this Annihilator can probably solo this guy. Let me solo him. There we go. Boom. 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 Put down there. Or actually, not let me solo him. It's let me solo her, boys. Uh, but, anyways. I'm going to put that out. Get the Ego Energy Efficient Barrier. I'm going to get all the upgrades first if possible. Uh, Stackbreaker is kind of a meme here, especially when you run into Gary, I mean Phoenix. There we go. Oh, Igor is just going to devastate most of that stuff, but eh, not going to devastate it enough. 
Oh, this is only 100 minerals now. Let's go. Um, <clears throat> boom, 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 boom. Okay, so I actually want to go back to Karax, I think. Do I? Yeah, I think I do. Let's put down some more Banelings here. Um, yeah, I want to I put down some Banelings. I'm going to switch to Karax last minute because I really just only want Karax for the uh, thingy. Outnumbered. Need more units. There we go. Uh, like more lings. I need to get to Zagara actually. Uh, let's switch to my guy, my guy Karax. He still does not have a single orbital strike beacon. Are you serious right now? Oh my god. I wanna I'm gonna put it on the Baneling. We got an orbital strike beacon that can stun stuff. I'm gonna put the Kedar monolith down here. Uh, boom. Oh no! I wasted the beacon! The beacon only triggers when the unit dies! Oh my god. Papega moment. Papega moment. I'm actually, I'm actually memeing right now. Um, I forgot that that's how it worked. Oh, then I can put on on the abs because abs are actually a unit that will actually just die, and that it is good when they die because they deliver their payload. Okay, well I'm just gonna put on my 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 laser beam and then help us power through with Chloraz's ginormous stack of annihilators. That'll just make quick work of buildings. Um, but I need some cigar action, actually. I'm actually- that was actually just like a forehead slap moment. I don't even know if my mic picked it up, because I literally slapped my forehead. I was like, oh my god. What did I just do? <laughs> Anyways, um, uh, optimized ordinance. I don't know if that only applies to when I'm on Karax, though. Oh no! It, it did deliver it! Okay. Okay, okay. There we go, dude has like five heroes. There we go, yes, that is part of the game. Where's my girl, Zagara? Uh, now, I actually don't want Zagara's uh, stuff, though. So. Uh, heroes of the Storm Brawl, there we go. Boom, Heroes of the Storm, RIP dead game, guys. Um, there we go, I'm gonna put down a bio launcher back here. And then we're just gonna go boom, boom. Um. Do I need Scourge? No, I don't need Scourge. We're just gonna Slappy Slappy. I don't think I want to use Splitterlings, though. The only way I'm gonna use Splitterlings is to cash them in. So I'm just gonna cash them in right now. If I'm not lagging. Boom. Alright, I'm just gonna put one of these guys on top. And then Broodmother. Boom. Boom. Oh my god. Our base. Protective cover. Get that stim. Get that stim. Come on. We got a lot of Banelings coming through. Uh, I don't have any of the Corrosive Acid though. I need to get that. Boom. There we go. Get the Artillery Ducks. Alright, it's just Kev here trying to breach those bases. Oh my god. Laser Beam. Freaking Laser Beam, boys. Oh, we got a Reaver. Reaver is actually like a stack breaking unit too. Oh my god, wait. That's actually, that's actually really good. Um, but I should probably also add in a bunch of scourge and stuff, you know. Um, we got the rupture here, but yeah, let's let's get some more of these guys. We got so many banelings. We're just gonna go beep beep and power through, and then once the battle cruisers show up, I'm just gonna buy scourge. Um, maybe, because I don't think there's a good stack breaking in it, right? For for those guys, actually, I think there might be, but it might not be as hot as it looks. Like um. I have like I think I think like the Terran Thors are actually pretty strong. Like they're pretty they're pretty slick with it when it comes down to it. There we go. Boom! Mutalisk dead. I never heard no Mutalisk before. Okay, boom. Gonna sell that back. Um. All right. Wait, is my dude playing Bog Standard Tychus? Big Standard Tychus? I think so. He is playing Pog standard Tychus. This is also Protoss into Tychus. Um, <clears throat> I do actually like the Reaver tech. I'll be honest, the Reaver tech is pretty good. That's some secret technology right there. I'm gonna go and switch into Reavers actually. I, I am inspired. Shield overcharge uh, does like takes a bunch of time to come up. So I think in order to uh, deal with BCs, we'll need to actually switch to Dahaka to like eat one of them. And then, like, uh, we'll have to figure out the rest ourselves. 
Uh, oh yes, I got three photon cannons, but not really because I already put down a bunch on Skarax. So there we go. Um, there we go. This guy's playing straight up brood lords. Insane. Um, well, I mean, actually, it's not a bad idea because I actually have no answer to it. I'm gonna vomit on that havoc. There we go. Um, well, how do I break a stack on the brood lords? Um, probably like a sky theory or something. Just save up some dollars and buy it. I said I was gonna go reavers, but I think uh, the objective has now changed. Nikara is healing this brood lord to full health. This is actually a scam. Yeah, I think Sky Furies plus Scourge would probably be a good, good combo. Um, unfortunately, you can't build the Guardian Shell on anything anymore. Like you have to like, you just like have to put it on Nartanus unit, which is like, eh, not the greatest. Um, oh my God, my abs got sealed away. So we got some Black Hammer action here. We got these guys coming in. I'm gonna actually switch to Manx here. Uh, I'm gonna get his bunker here, which I'm gonna fill with Rocket Boys, which I think should be able to hit the. Oh, I can't hit the Brood Lords, huh? Okay, well, I don't know. I'm just gonna prepare for the eventual need for Sky Furies. Uh, I'm actually gonna put them on the ground here. There we go, because they'll they'll be able to trans they'll be able to transform quickly. Chloras has his, has his VC out. Um, there we go. I'm gonna put that out here. Got my Earth Splitter. I'll put that down at some point. But I'm I'm just gonna farm a bunch of Sky Furies, like just have them down on the floor here, uh, and then I'll switch off Minx as soon as I can. And then uh, yeah, I mean two Sky Furies should uh, deal with Phoenix by himself as well. And then <clears throat> we gotta add more to the Stack Breaker. The Stack Breaker is looking a little lame right now. Uh, you gotta scan, boys. You gotta scan. Gotta, 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 gotta scan. Gotta, gotta scan. Um, uh, there we go. Skyfree's gonna make quick work of those wounded mutilisks there. Um, I'm gonna get smart servos. That's important. I'll get Earth Splitter as well. Uh, and this thing's a massive boy, so Skyfree's gonna make quick work of that guy. Uh, rip Rude Lords. Get some Skyfree's. Oh, and the battle cruisers are out, so that means it's my turn to get some battle cruisers out too. Where's Han and Horner? Uh, boom, boom, overcharge reactor. There we go. They're here. They're here, boys. Cauterize the area. Let's go. Let's make it happen. Boom, boom. I'm gonna put them in the back. Put them in the back, boys. There we go. We're st we're breaking some stacks right now. Uh, there's a bunch of invisible things here. Very, very annoying. Reported for hacking. Same. Same. Uh, Gary. There we go. Um. Boom. Boom. Come on, kill the brood lords. Oh my god. There we go. And then I need to switch over to Zagara. But I'm gonna upgrade my weapons here. Two two weapons are gonna be pretty good. And I actually have two Hellbats, so these guys are gonna be a little stronger than usual. 18 extra health. Let's go, boys. So Manx guys still gain AXP while you guys while you're not on Manx, so I think that is the strategy. Reavers I think might be better than um, uh, Abs, just because Reavers are the gift that keeps on giving, you know. Um, there we go. Yeah, Phoenix is just going to go down here so quick. Didn't stand a chance. Uh, <clears throat> I kind of want to just grab the upgrades first. And then switch over to uh, something else. Switch over to Zagara, probably. And get some Scourge. There we go. Lamau. That wave just fell over and died. Uh, where's my girl Zagara? I'm going to get my Stim here. So she's going to like Stim super fast. Uh, and then just gun everything down. Tychus with Abathur Queens to support him. But like, dude, stimmed up, stimmed up battle cruisers are kind of scary. I'll be honest. Uh, there's a bunch of battle cruisers here. This is just stack breaker, but we also have battle cruisers. I love it. Stack breaker, but we have battle cruisers. Somebody's trying to go for like a Stukov cruiser, uh, an Alexander. All right, boys. 
I got pinged. Does that mean we have an Alexander incoming? Is that what's happening? Alright, so it's probably a better idea to not have the Scourge fly in, on, in a line. Um, but, uh, that's what's happening. We should probably have them fly in on a wide front. Uh, that's okay, I got Sky Furies. And I got Alexander. I mean, not Alexander. I got, I got my, my guy. My guys. Alright, let's go. Where are my Scourge? Oh, they're getting sucked. They're getting sucked. Okay, Sky Furies. Come on, Sky Furies, take them out. There we go. My BCs are gonna be safe. Scourge kind of did not perform in the way they did. I think I'm actually put the Orbital Beacon on the, on the Scourge because they are more likely to just fall over and die um, than, say, the Banelings. I think sometimes the Banelings don't trigger because they use their death and their death attack. I don't know. Uh, there we go. Let's get some more. So apparently, I can upgrade a uh, Flyer Carapace. That does not exist. I'm guessing that's shields. And Hanahorn doesn't use shields. So there we go. Um, but yeah, like I was saying, I'm going to switch over to um, Vorzoon. Yes. I can go stealth on those guys. Oh my god. I'm going to put these guys into the hole. Put them in the hole, boys. Put them in the hole. Put them in the hole! Ah! Oh! Everything in that hole just got annihilated. The toilet, boys. The toilet. Zagara Vorazun toilet. The toilet. Oh my god, look at all those scouts. I'm thinking we're gonna need to call in our boy Rainer. Rainer with some invisible uh, Vikings. Can I make my sky freeze? Oh my god, I can. This feels illegal. Um... But Scourge actually aren't that great of a choice because they will eventually get overwhelmed by stuff like Corsairs. Alexander, 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 what am I going to do with you? Um, I can make my Scourge invisible. I don't see why I would do that though. <laughs> the true stack breaker is the ultimate stacker. You know, you break your opponent's stack by hard stacking. There we go, we got some invisible Sky Furies. Uh, which Alexander will probably have a harder time against. Um, there we go. Scourge making... Not really making much of an impact, because I think they're getting torn down before they can actually get anywhere. Uh, oh jeez. Come on, guys. Uh, oh my god! Invisible Sky Fury, boys! Invisible Sky Fury! Go and get him. Go and get him, Invisible Sky Fury. Alright, um... There we go. Uh, da, 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 da. what am I gonna do for stack? Uh, breaking the stack of flying air units. It's oh yes, my boy Rainer. There we go, Rainer. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I can get a battle cruiser myself if I want. Eh. I'm gonna cloak. I'm gonna cloak these Vikings too. Oh my god, there's a Hyperion here. Advanced optics. I need rip wave missiles. Get the Phobos weapon systems. Uh, I'm gonna need more Scourge. Alright, we got the Rainer weapons here. Um, um, we're gonna need more firepower. Actually, no, my Sky Fairies are just chilling here, man. They're just killing everything. They're just killing everything in sight. That's massive. Because uh, they're just invisible. So actually, I should probably... Uh, the Rainer Vikings are okay, but like I don't think they're gonna be game winning here. Um... I don't think they're going to be game winning here, so let's just uh, put down some more bunkers behind our bunker. There we go. I love it. Bunkernomics. We have a powerful battle cruiser here. I'm actually going to try and get this baby, because then I can build Rainer's uh, Hyperion whenever. And I, I don't have to stay on Rainer. Come on. Let me get off Rainer. Please. Thank you. Boom. And then I'm going to switch over to uh, somebody. Switch over to somebody called my boy Mengsk. I'm gonna switch over to my boy Mengsk here. Um, there we go. I'm gonna drop another scan. Where's my boy Mengsk at? I'm gonna need to get back to uh, Invisible Sky Theories. Please and thank you. Boom. Oh, that's a lot of Hydralisk. When did, when did we get so many Hydralisk there? Uh oh. 
Yeah, the invisible sky freeze are tearing it up here, boys. I think I need some more uh, some more abs on the ground. Um, there we go. Put that guy down. But yeah, I'm gonna keep my keep my battle cruisers in the back. Keep my invisible sky freeze. Got an invisible black hammer. Let's go. Kind of want that indoctrination here. Oh, that guy used it on just the reavers. That's a bit of a waste, boys. Don't use your blast just on the reavers. They aren't worth it. Got a bunch of tanks here. A bit of a stack that we gotta break. I like how this stack breaker just became like a sort of weird counter build with some Vikings mixed in. Or rather, some Banelings are mixed in. That looks like a fat stack though. Uh, there we go. Alexander just gonna disappear. Yeah, my invisible Sky Fears are just gonna rip them apart here, boys. Oh no, anything but the tanks. What else am I going to do? It's not like I can just ignore them by flying over them. Or something like that. Uh, okay, so I want to make sure these these are upgraded. Uh, I'm going to get the garrison level, and then I'm going to switch over to... Um, I think we need to be on our, our girl Zagara for a little bit. I don't know why this guy bought scouts of all the things that he could buy that was flying and anti-capital. I don't know why he bought scouts, but whatever it is, I hope he I hope he's enjoying those scouts of his boys. I really hope he's enjoying that purchase. Oh, we got double hole, double hole, double power. Um, totally no innuendos there. Uh, I'm gonna actually like throw down some splitterlings and like sauce them, sauce them. All right, boys, let's go. Bam. Oh my god, he stealthed the tanks? For real? Alright, how are we doing here? I am handling everything that flies at this point. I just need to handle everything that's on the ground. Uh, my invisible sky furies are just chewing things to shreds here. Um, I, actually, I actually realize I don't have a single detector in my army. Uh, and I don't intend to change that. Who needs detectors anyways? Um... They can detect these nuts. Uh, anyways. Um, how much is that? 790. So these guys are gonna about to go. They're about to go elite very soon. I'm gonna need some more abs. I think the air is done. Like, I think we're good. We're good on aerial threats here. Um, come on. And then if I can switch the Vora Zoom before my wave impacts, that would be nice. That would actually be very, very optimal. Uh, there's a lot of big... Big capital ship. This guy's getting some insane range here. What the heck? All right, where's Warzoon? She has her thing there. I'm gonna just boom, suck everything there in the middle, so they can't do anything. Oh my God, the carnage! Oh, oh, the carnage! Wait, I don't have a detector. <laughs> I don't have a detector. Same. Uh, who needs detection, man? Just be invisible. Then you guys can just walk past each other. Well, I'm gonna make a, I'm gonna make my Hyperion invisible too. That is gonna be big poggers. Big pog. I don't know if I want to make anything else invisible though. There's no, no point making the Banelings invisible because they're just gonna die anyways. Um, invisible Hyperion is gonna be great. Invisible Alexander is gonna be great. I can't believe this game has gone on for 24 minutes because we're supposed to break the a stack. Poor scouts, indeed. Indeed. Poor scouts, indeed. Uh, I don't think I actually have a single detector here, boys. I am not detecting anything. It's like roll for insight. Zero. Uh, you walk right past the giant orc. Uh, there we go. Lamau. My invisible vikings. Invis vikings. Lamau. It's actually abuse. Invisible Vikings is actually just abuse. Alright, I'm gonna get my boy. Oh my god, I can't build here. Okay, so he's gonna be invisible, but it doesn't look like it. Uh, invisible Hyperion. There we go. I'm gonna get that going, and I'm gonna switch up to kitchen. I'm gonna kitchen sink up here if I can. I'm gonna actually get. I'm gonna see if I can get Manx's detector. Or maybe I can get Alarak, eh? Let's switch to my boy Alarak. We need some we need some freaking Havocs in there here. We need some Havocs up in here, boys. We got like no range. 
Gimme, gimme, gimme. Oh my god. Never never a second havoc. Alright, let's go for that and let's go for that. So I, I disabled Hyperion's gun for now because I'm trying to like land a big juicy hit. And afterwards I gotta re-enable it. So I gotta remind myself that it's turned off. Uh let's go. Ooh. Devastation. Devastation. There we go. Havoc's revealing our opponents. Come on. <clears throat> I actually have a few more Sovereign BCs. Took Mira unregistered cloaking. There we go. Yeah, I have a few more BCs than I than I am uh, floating right now. So I should probably go and get access to those guys. Um, let's go for that. Attack weakness. There we go. I finally have some detectors. Oh my god. 26 minutes and I finally have a detector. You know it's a Wuju's game win. Not a single detector in sight. Even though there's a detector that can be bought from every single race, not a single detector in sight. I don't think Vipers are that great right now. Vipers are great when uh, there's nothing to protect Vikings, but considering I have such a giant stack of BCs to protect my Vikings, uh, yeah, that's going to be good. Did I turn this back on? Break it down. Nope. There we go. Haha. <laughs> Got it. Better than last time, at least. Uh, I'm going to go back onto my boy Han and Horner here. My boy and girl, thank you very much. We got two more BCs here. Boom, boom, there we go. Overcharge a reactor, there we go. 918 health. Invisible Hyperion. Oh my god, blink backwards. Friggin' scouts. Uh, we got some ravens. Actually, I kind of like the idea of putting down some ravens. Um, but, uh... Here, I'll put down two ravens here. Uh, and we'll get the we'll get the multi-threaded analysis. I'm not gonna get the tack jump for the ravens. Maybe I maybe I should. I don't know. Um, we got four BCs here. I got four whatever whatever things. Technically, the hawk is a stack breaker at this point because he's got his fire breath. Um, but you know what I should be doing? I should be getting on Stepman and churning out some banelings because I have not been doing that. Or some like um, corruptors even. Because the Corruptors can get rid of the fodder units quicker. Uh, and that'll really help. My Vikings? Actually, I don't even know, man. The Rainer Vikings are they're doing God's work right now. Like, Alexander just does not exist. He just disappears almost instantaneously. There's a, there's a poor little lurker there. there. This guy went cloak tanks. Don't cloak your tanks, please. Cloak your flying units. This guy just has a conga line of banelings. Uh, I'm gonna switch over to my boy Stetman. Uh, oh, actually, this could be a really good combo here. So I'm gonna switch to the juice here. Um, there's nothing to juice. Though. I should probably get Super Gary actually here. Put one of these guys down, and uh, get that Super Gary. There we go. There's no transformation though, like animation. That would be cool if, it, if there was. Uh, and then Lamau Carax and his Orbital Beam, which I, I mean Orbital Beacon, which I have not like used ever since I put it put one down. I have not used it since. Uh, so I should probably switch to Karax at some point. But right now I just wanna increase the breadth of my explosivity. There we go. Oh, I realize I'm missing an ab on that side. Oh well. Um there we go. Get that detonation going. I'm gonna penetrate deep into that formation. They have no detectors here. Um, actually, maybe they do. Eh, no, I still have my Havoc here. Uh, my Vikings are going to dominate those scouts. Uh, probably, at least. I think they're going to dominate those scouts. The scouts are... I think he has blood. Like, they're healing quite fast. Um, or does he just have Nikara healing them? He, he just has Nikara healing them. <laughs> so Nikara can heal with her burst heal. I swear it was always possible. I don't know. But it's just like was kind of a gimmick. Um, right, I need to switch on to my boy Karax though. All right, Karax, where are you? Where are you in your glorious face? Okay, I'm gonna put X, 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 X. There we go. That's way too many X's even for an inappropriate movie. There we go. Um, I'm gonna put down the phase detonation here, and then I'm gonna put down a fat beam. Oh, it's gonna annihilate his center formation. 
We have the detonator with the detonator with the detonator with the detonator that has a detonator that will detonate on the detonation of your detonator. Uh, oh, this is about to fire. Five more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Kill all those scouts. Kill all those scouts. Oh! 21 scouts. RIP, boys. Today is 2023 and scouts still suck. Can't confirm. <laughs> oh my god, 21 scouts just got one-shotted. Maybe not exactly 21, but it was definitely like a double-digit number of scouts that got one-shotted there. We can Hyperion, boys. We got the healing, the Karax healing repair. Karax is like, I got you. I'm actually going to get another one of these. These bad boys here. I'm going to get them to energize some stuff, you know? Get some energy in them. I might need to get a... I could get an Alex, maybe. You know, save some dollars. But Alex is kind of... Eh. Kind of eh. Like, oh my god, I got a science vessel on my head, period? Like, jeez. He invisible and he babysitted. He's been babysitted. Babysat. Babysitted. -did 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 -did. He's been babysat. Um... I should get a Stukov Queen and put a detector on my on my abs so that the front line can detect the the enemy front line. Uh, I'm just gonna stim it up here maybe. Hit him with the stimmy. Uh, or is that worth it? Mm. Yeah, let's hit it with the hit him with the stimmy, boys. Hit him with the stimmy. Hit him with the stimmy. I mean, stim stim BCs are kind of scary. Uh, that wave actually cleaned up this wave with the stim. Like Chloros's wave like arrived, but like. Like, he kind of arrived to, like, see everything, like, has already been destroyed. Um, so yeah. We are breaking some stacks, boys. Um, not enough minerals. Not enough minerals. Oh, one of our opponents left. Purple. Um, uh, that was the guy I was facing. Um, that's unfortunate. Did he lag out, or did he just say, like, I surrender? Archon Psystorm kind of scary though. That just shredded all those Scourge. Uh oh. I'm a little worried. Whatever. That's what the other stack breaking units are for. Uh oh. Oh my Scourge. Ow. Oh well. That's why you have Vikings to back them up. <laughs> Sometimes the Scourge die. So you just introduce them to the Vikings instead. There we go. Boom. Sell these guys. I would say Vikings are a stack breaker unit. I don't know what, I don't know what you guys think. Oh wow, that was a lot of money from those banelings. Gimme, give gimme. Give that was two abs worth of money from those banelings. Delicious. Uh, kinda wanna get one more ab. At the end of the day, whoever wins the ground wins the war, so... Just another ab and then we should be fine. There we go. How's Super Gary doing? He's doing, he's doing just fine for himself, thank you very much. I'm actually gonna switch to Artanis, uh, cause Artanis is a shield. No, it recharges every time?! Ah, uh, why would they do this, Tia? Why would you make this super OP abusable ability balanced? I can't believe it. And then like goes ahead and guts Hun and Horner's basic units. Uh, what's a stack breaker? Yeah, I can get a Reaver. Reavers is just banelings, but like in a gun. You know what? I'll do that. Reavers is just a ba it's a baneling machine gun, so I'm gonna go for it here. Where are my anti-cap ships? Got my Viking squadron back here. How many Vikings do I have? Only six. Uh, should probably get more. That's not a lot. Six Vikings is definitely not a lot. Um. All right. Anyways, I'll put the Reavers on the side because, like, I don't know. Maybe that'll help them survive. Alright, Reaver, can I can I select just the Reaver? Thank you. There we go. We put the Guardian Shell on the Reavers because I'm not going to be using them on anything else because I'm not going to buy anything else, I think. Uh, I'm going to call in some more Rainer Vikings, though. I love that this is such a late game build, though. Like, I don't think I've had a Kitchen Sink game go this long. But I think it's because this is the end of the week. Like, I'm filming this on a Thursday, basically before the Brawl resets. Uh, and so, yeah, like, everyone, like, just knows what's going on, you know? Uh, Scarab Housing, Scarab Payload. Give me those research first, and then we'll go from there. Um, I think I actually want to get back on Rainer. Uh, and get some more Vikings. Get some more Vi get some more of that Viking action. Um, 
Yamato is going to be... I don't think I'm going to see my Yamato. The amount of scouts here is actually a little bit concerning. Um, um, there we go. My research is all complete. I'm going to switch over to my boy Rainer. I'm going to call those in. Got some Rainer scans going on here. Uh, oh, I don't have my Hyperion upgrade. Advanced targeting systems. I'm going to get that. Uh, wait, I get minus five minerals for my marine. Does that mean I get, I get minerals when I put this marine down? Hey, let's go! This marine gave me minerals. Yo, that guy's free. That guy's free. Oh my god, I get, I got money back, bro. Cash back marines. Let's go. Now that's what I'm talking about. We're truly living in the 25th century. The marines give us money back. Every marine I build makes me richer. Oh my god. I love that fact. <sighs> oh my god. There's just a random Nikara here. Uh, Alright, Yamato Cannon. Get ready to fire. On my command. Uh, actually, I want to annihilate a bunch of scouts. I don't think this is the guy with the scouts. Uh, go backwards. Uh, I might need some more... Oh, whatchamacallit's Sky Theories. All right, boys. Where are the scouts? There they are. Ooh! I'll add like half of the scouts there. The rest of the scouts are caught in the black hole. Okay, I, I need to get off Rainer and get into uh, Vorzun. Uh, more ways than one. Uh, and then I can stealth these guys. And then also get some Viking action in there. That is uh, invisible. And we can uh, put them all in the hole. Alright, where's Warzone? Put him in the hole, boys. C. C. Uh, I'm gonna stealth this one Marine. Wait, I can make my Reavers invisible? That's insane. I got invisible Reavers with the be with the beacon. Um, and then now we just gotta put him, put him in the hole. And it's over. See, this ability is not on a cooldown every time you switch in. But the other one, the Artanis Shield is. I mean, I guess our Tannish Shield is like something you can like abuse and like stack over and over again, but like still, this is a pretty powerful ability. You know, if I do say so myself. Now put everybody in the hole. There we go. Everything that goes in there just gets annihilated. That's the blender, boys. Will it blend? Yes, it will. It will blend fabulously. Um, oh my god. I feel like I'm just not stack breaking hard enough right now. Like, uh, maybe I should have, like, I don't know. Maybe I should have more, like, um, Sky Theories, you know? I only have four. I think it's probably time to get up to, like, 50. And then, uh, the abs on the ground should be able to handle most things. Oh my god, we're so close, boys. But then again, like, Sky Theories kind of suck into all of these guys here. Um, like the Rainer Vikings is what I need more of to clear up these scouts. It's like, scouts just have a lot of HP, man. They just, like, don't die. Koraz is invisible Vikings. They're trying to do stuff. You know what I need? I need a Nux. Who is gonna blast this area with his psionic storm. Or I'm just tripping. I don't know. Um... Uh, or I can get some Ravagers. Because Ravagers, like, just have a lot of AoE right now. Yeah, let's do it. Where's Avatar? Where's my boy Abathur at? He got 39 biomass, boys. He a bad boy with that biomass. Mm, give me your big biomass. There we go. I'm gonna drop a fat mend here. I'm gonna drop another mend. And then we're just gonna drop another mend. Um, I'm thinking I could just get some Ravagers and then like just plug it away. Like Ravagers on one side. Friggin... Whatever I'm gonna call it's on the other side. Oh my god, I'm broke. I forgot these things cost five million dollars. Oh, there we go. Boom, 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 boom. I can get ten biomass ravagers. Oh my god, give me, give me. It's like reavers on one side, ravagers on the other. If I can get my ravagers to land their hits on the scouts, that would be insane. This is probably the longest game I've had in a long while, and I love it. Oh my god, yellow is down. But who's left? It's just this guy. 
I mean, this guy's got the stealth tank. I think yellow was stronger, though. Oh, man. Well, this is probably the end of the game, boys. All our opponents have left. I can't add Dark Pylon to my Hyperion. Uh, you gotta put it on. You gotta put it on before it transforms. Nope. Never mind. I I'm supposed to send out to all. I think that guy was on the enemy team. <laughs> but this guy looks like he's green too. Right? That's Bucket, right? Oh, that guy's beta. Oh my god. Bucket, beta. They both look like they're green. Come on, Ravagers. Hit him right here. Ravagers. Oh my god. I just need to use all that biomass. That Ravager biomass, boys. That good, good biomass. I'm gonna drop a fat man here. We have an August grad coming in. Jesus. August grad AoE, I kind of actually have to respect because it's going to be every single wave. Um, you can make your August grad invisible though, so that's that's definitely something to be worried about. Um, uh, hello? Ravager? There we go. Ravager? There we go. I, wish I, I wonder if I can buy regular Ravagers and then biomass them like Avatar does. Um, that August Grad is going to be a problem. The Stepman Baneling and which one is Zagara? Lamal. Lamal. Oh my god. Uh, I have a bunch of Toxic Nests which I'm pretty sure I don't want to put down because they kind of just take up space uh, in our already like crowded area. Alright Ravagers, how are you guys doing? I think the August Grad every wave is definitely doing something, boys. Definitely le leaving a lasting impact. Uh, I'm also I also haven't summoned more BCs in a while, so let's do that. Uh, let's do that, and then let's go for H and H. Uh, and then we got some more BCs. More BCs. Oh my god. More BCs. The lag, oh my god. Switch over to big guns. Um, down some more mag mines. Oh, I have another BC. I have one more BC. Wow. I just put down four BCs, right? I had four. No, I put down three. Okay. Put down three. I put down three. Um, but damn. Alright. We're not breaking the stack really hard here, but... I don't know. We got some corruptors here. All those corruptors are dying, becoming scourge. Uh, bucket hole really just plowed right through there, boys. Um, got some Stukov guys. Got Kerrigan coming in there. Uh, do I have my Yamato up here? Not yet. I think I need my I need I need a Manx BC. I'm gonna run out of space. Manx's BC is actually the smallest of all these guys. Boom, boom, boom. I have a lot of BCs. My BCs are just gonna obliterate everything. Uh, there we go. Yep. I have too many BCs. I have air superiority, boys. I have the high ground. I have the high ground. Gotta remember to switch back to Hunter Horner from time to time. Especially when it's a 40 minute game, you're gonna have so many BCs. I'm actually out of space. I, I think I need to buy more uh, of these bad boys. Um, I'm gonna run out of space, boys. Yes, commander. Yes, indeed. Uh, well, Manx is over here because he's he's new. Uh, he's new here. Boom. Put another one of these guys down. Rank up a sky theory here. I'm gonna get the hemispheric accelerants so we can actually bombard the enemy side of the field. Um. Oh my god. If I can switch to Swan just to get the laser beam so we can break the stack a little faster. Um, oh my god. Garrison level 2. Come on. Holy. 
I think I might need more groundbreaking forces, you know? More groundbreaking discoveries. Um, but then again, the ground forces seem to like melt away pretty quickly. Uh, for the most part. I don't know, the invisible tanks definitely doesn't help. Uh, but the Ravagers are doing a big number. Uh, and my invisible Reavers in the back are, well, they're chilling, I guess. Uh, oh my god, such a huge wave of getting locked up. Uh, I think I should just get a pride just for the Yamato mm, that it's got. The AoE Yamato is, is like something to die for. Uh, saving for pride. So many battle cruisers. So little opponents. Oh my god. Uh, lots of BCs coming in. Welcome to the end game. <laughs> oh my god. We got corruptors everywhere. I think honestly the, the end game stack is definitely Rainer. Just filled my field with Vikings on the ground and like free marines and fire bats that give me money when I buy them. <laughs> oh my god. Um, that's when you know the game's gone on long enough that I, you've made money off of your hero power. Got the fire breath there, boom. The scourge are just like doing half of the health of one BC. So really not that great actually. Um, the guy with the scouts is gone. Um, let's see. Oh my god, strike weapons 5? I think I've been here like once or twice. In a very, very light, like a lifetime ago, boys. There we go. I'm gonna fill that guy up. Uh, I'm gonna see if I can, can I put a, I can put a 3x3 three three BC in here for sure. Alright, I'm going to put the August Grad in the back corner. Um, I'm going to put the August Grad in the back corner. If I can even acquire one, that is. Because um, it's taking forever for me to save the dollars. To get one. Oh my goodness. These Apox are just constantly charging forward here. we got the slideshow coming in. This guy's playing just pure Zagara. He's like, I don't need other commanders. Other commanders are weak. Me? I'm strong. All I need is Zagara. Gimme, 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 gimme. No. Oh. Oh. Oh, there we go. We got it. We got it. We got it. We got it. All right. We're getting out of here, boys. Uh, We're going to go to Vorzun, actually. Where, where's my girl Vorzun at? There we go. We're going to put him in the hole. Ready? It's holy time. Um. Uh, Put all those guys in the hole. And then I just gotta make my guys invisible right now. So August Grad's gonna be invisible. That's gonna be invisible. These guys can't be invisible. Dear AoE, I love you. Oh my god. Freaking AoE stack breaker. I don't wanna make these guys invisible. Can't make those guys invisible. So basically I'm just gonna be saving dollars on Borzoon basically. Um Ally Attend. There we go. I still don't have Alexander. Lumao. But, eh. Who needs Alexander? Who needs Alexander? The Vortex with AoE, boys. There we go. Vortex AoE is insane, boys. Warzone is the only commander who has no built-in AoE, but the Vortex makes it so insane that like once you combine that with AoE, it's like, ah, delicious. Um, I'm gonna switch over to Kitchen Sink or something like that. Switch over to Kitchen Sink, switch over to, to somebody else, I don't know who it's gonna be. Maybe I'll switch over to Swan and save some dollars, I don't know. Uh, but we're so close. You know what I need? I need to please Zagara. I think we need more detonation. Um, did my August grad just get eaten? I swear I saw my August grad flying over. There's a bunch of uh, Hyperions here now. This guy has Tempest. 
Um. Um. Eh. I think we're okay. I'm actually gonna go back to Rainer. Um. We'll drop a fat scan here. Okay, so I think, uh. Wait, these guys don't give me money back right now? Oh, that's kind of lame. That's kind of lame. I, I had a marine that gave me five minerals back. I want that again. Give me five mineral marine. Maybe I can't go over the limit because I go over limit. Then it's like, you know, you fell over the edge, punk. And then, uh, and then, uh, I don't get any dollars back. Come on, come on. More Vikings. More Vikings, boys. More Vikings. Got the Sky Fairies leading the Vikings. Um, I think if I stay here, I get 15% increased attack speed on Rainer as well. So that could be very good. We're going to get Strike Weapons 6. Jesus. I want to see how fast these Vikings are attacking with all that attack speed bonus. Um, come here, boys. Wait, I only have 125 health? Is it because they're not considered Rainer Vikings anymore? Oh my god. Wait, what? My Vikings are glitched. Is my Hyperion glitched? No, my Hyperion is always the same. Okay. Interesting, interesting. Um, I, just, I just need a Viking my way through all this. And then we'll sh we should be fine. Because all these capital ships are just going to fly into the jaws of death. A.K.A. my Vikings. And then... Uh, I just need a little bit more penetrative power on the ground, which is probably going to have to come from more abs. Uh, oh, Vikings getting locked up there. I want to get some more abs. I'm going to switch over to Zagar after this. Uh, boom. Boom. There we go. These Ravagers with their ground-based AoE going to do okay, I guess. I think I want to have more... Uh, abs on this side because they the tanks on the other side always seem to like just end up surviving that's very frustrating i don't want any tanks surviving whatsoever uh where's my girl zag that's not zag there we go uh that's a lot of banelings that's like 660 minerals give me that uh sell them all give me some more abs give me those abs i'm gonna ab money I'm gonna probably also want to get some uh, some reavers as well. Uh, give me that ab revenue, boys! Oh my god! Strike weapons. Got some more of these guys. I think we're we're getting close, boys. We're getting close. We're getting close. Beta here is holding out as hard as he can, boys. I hit that stim. Hit that stimmy. Yeah, you know we hit that stim. I hit that scan too. Someone's gonna be like, oh my god, would you stop scanning? And I'm gonna be like, no. Never. Alexander gonna go down. All those Vikings are just gonna go down. I mean, I, I mean, all those BCs are just gonna go down in the face of my Viking swarm. Um, we still have some uh, Reavers here it's just hammering those positions. The Reavers seem to be the gift that keeps on giving, so I gotta go to Artanis now, I think, and get some more Reavers. The abs are like, they're doing good for, for what they're doing, but like, eh. I was going to save that money, but I guess I auto-casted it, so that's my fault. Uh, oh my god, literally this morning I had a dream that I was like in, a, in in Cyberpunk. I haven't played Cyberpunk in like two weeks, just 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 uh, as a disclaimer, but I was like in Cyberpunk, and I was like, I was like, yo, I'm going to stall for everyone to get out of this situation. And I just remember in my dream, I was like, I'm going to hit the Sandy! And then everything went time stop, and then uh, we pulled out the katana boys. That was, I was, and I woke up and I was like, damn, that was actually kind of a hype dream. It was like I was playing cyberpunk, but I was also sleeping at the same time. Um, anyways, I think I've only reached strike weapon seven in like one or two games. This is like some mythical hours, boys. I think it was like a longest game ever or something on my channel somewhere at some point that like we got to this point and we actually reset the image icon but like damn i gotta check my hard drive space do i even have enough hard drive do i have enough pp left for this okay there we go uh i'm gonna switch over to my my boy artanis here oh my god look at all those points he's got 
That was juicy, juicy points. There we go, Artanis. Uh, I'm gonna put you over here. I'm just gonna, yeah, I'm just gonna summon some more of these guys here. How many Reavers do I have in total? Three, that's what I thought. And how did I get so many Reavers there? Um, I don't even know. Damn, boys. We're in the end game now. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure the Vikings are just gonna win it for us here. I just gotta get more Vikings. This guy theoretically can have the most Vikings because he spawns every single wave. Uh, I should probably put my boy Dahaka down as well because I feel like uh, at this point he is kind of a stack breaker. But also like a bit of an AoE tank. I don't even know anymore. Uh, Not enough minerals. There we go. Hit X on that guy. This thing is still leveling up. Oh my god. Hello, August grad. Uh, 147 kills. Most of those were scouts back when the scouts were still here. Skyfreeze with 70 something kills. 50 something. Okay, the Skyfreeze are definitely leading the pack here. Uh, Super Gear with 226. Damn, how many kills does Zagara have? 76. Oh, there's space for an ab here, right? No, no, there's an ab right on top of her. Okay, I just couldn't see. Um, you know what? I might just save up for our Tana shield. It's like three minutes, right? I don't know. Shield overcharged, and then like uh, swap over to more Han and Horner BCs. I'm gonna run out of space for BCs. I think I need more Scourge. I think I need more Scourge, indeed. Because uh, I've never bought more Scourge since the beginning of the game. Uh, uh, that's a lot of Vikings. I think my line is thicker though. Is my line thicker? We have the Yamatos coming in. Uh, there's a lot of ground units that survive. Wait, that's my August grad. He's just chilling, man. My Vikings are still. Yep, we definitely smashed that. Okay. We smashed that like button. Why is there a beam over there? Um. I'm going to put down another Reaver because I think the Reavers are kind of helpful. Okay, so we're going to go Han and Horner again. Got to cash in oh, only a single BC this time. So I need to actually... Yeah, I'm going to put this guy over here. Switch to the Reactor. I'm going to need more Scourge. I'm going to fill up any of the weird spots with Scourge, I guess. There's going to be a lot of weird spots that are like open. Um, we are almost out of defensive structures. Oh my god. Put those guys down over there. Um, do I even want Deimos Vikings at this point? Because maybe those will be better than Rainer Vikings. I don't even know. This game is never going to end, boys. Um, good thing I don't have work tomorrow. In in like the standard sense. Because um, it's like a rest day for the kids. Uh probably get some more ravagers oh my god this guy's infestors i love that this guy has a bit of everything and it's like really working out for him uh, he's actually overpowering our formation boys with his consistency oh my goodness he's spawning every wave oh my god we got some zagara stims coming in here we got some stimmies oh my god come on I don't think I have enough Vikings. I think that's the problem. I think that is genuinely the problem. I don't know. Actually, I don't know. It seems like I am kind of winning this fight. Oh my god, I got another BC. Let's go. Uh, okay, so I have to... Oh my god, there's a friggin' raven in the way. Uh, uh, there we go. There we go, put that down here, and then switch over to this, and I think in the spot where I have the raven, I have all of this like open space, I can probably just fill that with uh, Scourge, and then like have them charge in. Uh, but we're slowly going to lose our bunker here, because all the frontal defenses have been peeled away, but we do have lots and lots of defenses here. Uh, uh oh. I need to go over to my girl Zagara. 
Uh, come on. Uh, let's go abs. Um, oh my god, what else? Oh! Is normal mothership heroic? I think so. I don't even know. Yes. Oh, because then you have normal mothership can stealth everything. Uh. Oh my god, come on. So I realized, yeah, with normal mothership can stealth everything. One way to find out. Koraz is gonna get a get a normal mothership. My wave just barreled through everything here, and then now uh is about to die to the next section of wave. Um Come on boys. Got some Viper action here. Uh, wow, my BCs went down real quick there. Um, damn. I think stealth is really the only thing we got going for us. We've got Alarak on the supercharge. With like one like shove, he could just delete everything. Oh my god, he's eating the nuggies. Oh my god, he died. Uh, okay. I'm gonna remove these guys. I'm gonna drop a cell here. Um, yeah, I don't even know if I need oversee. I, like, I need I need a detector unit that like doesn't die easily, which is like a problem because everything dies easily right now. Um, maybe I could get Nova. Uh, but why would I even dream up such an idea? I think I could get some normal Thors, because they have anti-massive cannons against air units. Uh, which, I don't know how much that would help in the long run. Um, but in the short run, it might be okay. Um, but this is kind of bad. There's a lot of abs coming at I mean, not abs. Um, these things. Apox coming at us. Oh, uh, it is heroic. Okay. Damn. Come on, boys. Smash it. The enemy Dahaka there is huge. Uh, I think I still need to. I need to get some more of these. More abs. There we go. Come on. Come on, computer, you can handle it. Okay, where's my where's my boy Dahaka? Oh my god. Got my money refund. I'm gonna get nerd I'm gonna get Dahaka here. I don't know where I'm gonna put him though. He's a bit big. He's a bit of a big boy. Oh my god, he's huge. Just put him down and he's huge. Okay, I'm gonna put this down here. You got a worm? Uh, I can probably get okay, so I can get the I can get the fire breath. Get that, get that, get that, get that. Uh, get that, get that, get that, get that. I'm gonna get all three points of that, 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 that. Oh, yeah, the hawk of me at the taxi would be good. Oh my god, what am I doing? And then we have deadly reach already. Oh my god, I just put down a fully evolved the Wow. Uh, there we go. Put down our worm there. Put that down over there. Get that tech up. Um, at this point, it's not even stack breaker anymore. I, I don't know what it is. So we got those anti anti massive Thors here, forty seven Punisher cannons. Those guys attack fast, but the regular Thor hammers are kind of eh. They are pretty kind of eh. We are gonna need one big swing ability here to to save our butts. All right, let's go. Get that AoE here. My big boy Dahaka there. He's so huge. We got focus fired almost immediately. Um, oh my god. The abs are going to pour over to the next wave along with my Reavers. Not doing much though because the Reavers kind of ran out of ammo. Uh, actually, I don't know. I feel like my wave is doing quite a lot of damage here. But also, you know, it could also be favoritism. Uh, like, look at those guys. These guys are shredding us here. 
We got our Tannis shield coming up here. Clora is actually dedicating four whole minutes to stay on our Tannis here to get those shields running. Um, I think the main problem is I am not winning the sky at all, boys. The sky people, boys. If you watch Avatar, you will know. Avatar the way of water. Uh, oh, we lost our guy, Bucket. Uh, that might be a good thing. Might be a bad thing. I don't even know. It's just Cloraz and I left. Holy. Let's get a worm here, boys. Oh my god. Oh my god. The lag. Okay, the Haka, like, just died instantly. Um. I'm gonna switch over to my girl, Vorazoon. And then just put everything here into the hole. So we can, like, just obliterate it. Phyrexian style. Hit him with the Phyrexian obliterator, boys. Oh my god. My wave definitely did not do as much as I wanted it to do. Like, it was kind of flaccid there. Uh, boom, boom. Come on. Come on. I, I, need the, I need the Karak's, like, detonation thing as well. Uh, let's see. I'm going to put that over there. Put that on that. Uh, I actually can't even see that last reaver. That's there somewhere. Um, I can't even make it invisible if I wanted to. Oh my god. August grad on the 31. Uh, holy. I think I need more Vikings. Which means I should probably just stick on Raynor. Rather than say I need more Vikings and then build onto other commanders that have zero Vikings available. Oh my god. Also the ground units, uh, I think I'm a bit lacking here. Holy. Yeah, we're getting shreddy. We're getting turned to shreddies here. Shredded beats. We got the Punisher cannons. I can hear them going off, boys. We got the regular mothership. Regular mothership seems so weak. It's only it has less health. It's basically as healthy as a Gary. Uh, it's like slightly tankier than a Gary. Gary hasn't having 500. Man, 350, 350. How is that a mothership, boys? I think a carrier actually has uh, in a slightly more stats than a carrier, I guess. But like a Taldarim mothership. Now that is a mothership, you know. Um, okay, where's my boy Rainer? Drop a hot scan on him. Alright. Um, Rainer, 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 Rainer. More Rainer. There we go. I need more Vikings, boys. My Vikings being 125 health is not helpful, though. Uh, oh my god, the lag. Oh my god. Floraz with the mothership coming out here, stealthing everything. Um, I'm about to switch to basic Terran, honestly. I don't even know, boys. Like, basic Terran, just anti massive doors. But they're gonna suffer from the Goliath problem, so, like, I don't know if I really wanna do that. You know? All my defensive structures coming up right at the same time. That is perfect. My tattoo's getting a little itchy, which is not perfect. In fact, that is the opposite of perfect. I'm just gonna crush these guys here. Maybe I can get some more Abathur Biomass Ravagers. But I don't think they're really doing that much in the grand scheme of things, it seems. Um, maybe Biomass Vipers would do a good job. But I don't know. Um, I just gotta have more Vikings, I think. Um, maybe I can get some Deimos Vikings. Or some, some Mirages, even. I don't know. Um... We got a little black hole coming around. Alarak going for a little spin there. I can't even see that black hole because everything is stealthed. My graphics card is gonna like explode or something. I don't even know, boys. We have like tier nine or something. Oh my god, tier nine, boys! Let's go. We got even more essence. I leveled up. Like the Haka has no more skills. I, I can't level everything up now. He's level 15. He has 170 attack. There's nothing more that I could want at this point. Um, 
I'm gonna switch over to like somebody, I don't know. Switch over to Zagara. There we go. Drop a fat stim. Drop a fat stim. How fast are these Vikings attacking? Oh my god. Points. They're attacking twice every second, basically. That's actually kind of nuts. Um, yeah, that fat stim actually did a considerable amount of damage there. Oh my god, we got a raven coming in. I heard a dee 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 dee. Um, oh my goodness. I can't even tell what's happening anymore, guys. Can you guys tell me what's happening? <laughs> oh my god, it's like watching a kid's show, like Dora the Explorer or something. It's like, can you tell me what's happening? <sighs> oh my god. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna get rid of these banelings. Give me some more money. Give me some more money. It looks like we're slowly pushing back down the middle. Um, so that's good. Perhaps we will finally have a resolution to this game. Uh, that is favorable for us. There we go. Not enough minerals. Actually, my central uh, stack is pretty weak. I don't really have many units in the center. My flanks are really strong. But my center is basically empty. Uh, so the center is just going to collapse, basically. Maybe that's the problem. My center has just been collapsing. You know? It's been pulling too much of a guagamela. Uh... Uh, or is it Gaugamela? Gaugamela, I don't know. As the ancient Greeks would have pronounced it. Um, oh my god! There we go. This looks like the kind of turn that we're looking for. I'm gonna drop a fast scan so you guys can see what's going on here. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna switch over to my boy Karax. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Oh my god. He's got the bright glowing eyes. And then I'm gonna drop my fat beam right on his face. Um, come on. Oh, we got the mending here. Come on, boys. Where is he? Where is he? Uh, there he is. There he is. There he is. Oh my. I missed him. I missed him. I missed him. Uh. Alarak pushed everyone back into place. Thank you, Alarak. You are a homie. So I'm gonna put that on there. Put that on there. Put that on there. Put that on there. Put that on. Oh my god! I make sure I'm hitting the right guys. Actually, I can't. I can't put it on the Ravagers, so I have to be putting it on the Abs. So that's fine. There we go. There we go. Unless I ended up putting on a. Did I put this on a Ravager? Oh my god! The game glitched out so much. I actually put it on a Ravager. Yo, I broke the game, guys. One of my Ravagers has biomass. I mean, the detonator on them. Yeah, with the detonator here, then, like, everything is just going to detonate so much harder. Oh, my God. I get the advanced repair systems for 50. Uh, yeah, like, everything is just going to detonate on, a, on them. Get the optimized emitters here. I don't even know anymore. Drop a fatty scan. Look at all those invisible units, man. Look at all of those invisible units. I just can't break past. I don't know what I, I don't know what I I need to push through this impasse. I could literally field my field with Vikings and cover it with abs. But even then I don't know if I'll be able to push past this impasse. This is like World War I, boys. Maybe I do need a Nux. Maybe Nux could do something, you know? I don't know. Fat size storm probably won't do much though. I do need a detector that like can constantly be detecting. Uh, and I don't have anything like that right now. Uh, uh, who else has massive air AoE? Eh, not really Phoenix. Uh, wow, capital ships are dropping like flies. Um, the Haka. Uh, 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 this might be the longest game this week. Wow, that's saying a lot because I think Chloros has definitely played a few more games than I have. I'm gonna go for Manx actually. 
Uh, and we're just gonna get another friggin' August grad. We're just gonna drown this thing in August grads. I'm gonna get a second August grad. I'm gonna get two more. Okay. Oh my god. Just gonna. Somehow I have more than one Phoenix. Oh my god. He broke the game. Alright. Until the game wins. Until the game ends. I'm just gonna buy Augs. Double the pride, double the fun, boys. Oh my god. This guy has two phoenixes. He's probably lagging so much he was able to put down a phoenix in another form. And the other phoenix never got recalled into his hand. Or, I don't know, wherever he goes. Uh, this guy's an... Oh my god. Oh my god. Come on, Rocket Boy Bunker. Take him down. There we go, Rocket Boy Bunker. That has unfair advantage, man. He has two phoenixes. This game is going on for so long right now. I think I need a... Oh my god, it's 12? It was 11 when I first started this game. Jesus Christ. Uh, there we go. Oh my god. Oh my god. Uh -huh. We're on, look, we're back at the beginning. We've gone full circle. We have 10 strike weapon levels. That's a, uh, actually that, that's 90% attack speed increase. It doesn't feel like it, but like the game is probably like so laggy that it is 90% increased attack speed. I don't even know anymore. And we move twice as fast. Um, oh my god. Like I feel like uh, we definitely need some prides to end this game, but I don't think I got enough AoE. And this guy's summoning prides every wave. Um, boom. Holy. Got 100 kills on that BC. 187. Jesus. Um. Oh, yeah, I can probably get this. Grant your nearby range ground units. Wait, I have no nearby range ground units besides friggin' Reavers. That was a waste of dollars. Um. <laughs> Same. Maybe I can get some swan goliaths and see if they help. You know, solve the goliath problem, get them to walk up and like go brrr. Uh, but I'm not, I'm not optimistic because swan goliaths are very fragile creatures. They're going to get run over by like the apox. Mm, since there are such heavy apox presence, maybe I should just get some... Uh, I could just get some immort immortals. Oh my god, we need some Zelnaga enforcers, boys. That would certainly make a huge difference. Um, yeah, these these freaking guys here are causing a lot of trouble. They're actually like tanking my my uh, abs with impunity. Uh, so I might just switch to Artanis. All right, let's go. Get that Artanis action going. Um, um, I'm gonna be out of space here. I am already out of space here. Uh, I don't think I want Reavers, because they'll run, just run out of ammo. And then they'll be unable to attack these guys. I think I just put a guy underneath the Haka. I don't even know. Um, yeah, I definitely can't put any buffs on those guys, because like they're just underneath everything. Um, um, Z... At least we can't guardian shell everything now, so at least I have some control over what gets buffs. Um, yes, commander. Oh my god, there's an immortal in there somewhere. There's so many layers of units. Uh, uh, where's my immortal? There we go. Can I just select? Can I select all the immortals like this? I can't. Okay, I have to rotate my screen probably. Oh my god, rotating my screen is lagging me. Uh, uh, uh. There we go. Gotta hit the guardian shell on those guys. Oh my god, come over here again. Holy. Oh, I have I have two photon cans I can put down. Don't mind if I do. 
I think my photon cannons are down right now, so now I suddenly just gain two photon cannons. Nice, 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 nice. I'll take advantage of those. There we go. Um, I don't think I'm gonna have enough airspace. That's us after a certain point. I'm just gonna have to fill every nook and cranny with scourge. Maybe, maybe that'll do it. Oh my god. I'm planning on Borzun and stealth all my Vikings as well. Uh, oh, I forgot my uh, my Immortals get like memed on by the Vipers. I forgot about that part. Um, and my wave actually just got completely obliterated. I think that's it. We just lose here. Those Apox just slammed us a little too hard. Um, Oh my god. The base is under attack. The base is under attack! Save it! I can't even switch to our hero! Ah! I wanna switch to Zagara. There's two Hyperions out right now. Situation very, very dire. Uh. Alright, sell these guys. Come on, let's go. Give me, give me another. Give me another ab. Give me another ab. Oh my god, our base is going down. We have nothing left to hold. We cannot hold. Wow, what a game, boys. Jeez. Are these two both his phoenixes? Oh my god. I want to see this guy's board, man. Oh my god, wait. Look at all the phoenixes he has. What? Dude, he has so many feet. He built Phoenix like he's building Dragoons. What? Bro, that was unfair. No wonder we lost. The Phoenix AoE, man. The AoE got us. The AoE got us, boys. Phoenix AoE, man. Let's get an overview here. Two million damage. I did like slightly more than Chloras. This guy did 3 point, almost 3.5 million. I killed a lot of units there, but it was not enough. This guy killed 17,000 units. Oh my god. Not burned now. Well, if you guys enjoyed this game, be sure to leave a like. I'm gonna go check all the kill counts first before we leave. Gary, I think, has the most kills. He has 300. The Hawker is probably buying him super late. Uh, he still has 44. Um. Uh, wow. Um. Uh, I think my what is it? Sky Furies had quite a bit of kills as well. 100 kills here. What's this guy got? Well, that was essentially the same guy. I click. That's the third guy. Who's the first guy? Okay, Sky Furies doing okay. These guys didn't even get sold sold out. Man, I think I think just like the Phoenix glitch, I should have taken advantage of that voice. That would have been so helpful because then he could just like. Because this Phoenix Blast has like 100 damage each, and he has like... How many of these does he have? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. He has 10 Phoenixes. I think it was 11 Phoenixes. I see another one in there. Oh, wow. Anyways, I'll see you guys later. The tires! Let's light some fires! They picked the wrong fight.